guys so if you haven't noticed I have a new background and now I'm kind of blocking my light glare but I have a lot of Frieza pieces and you can't see everything because it's almost impossible but right now this is not I don't think how I'm going to set it up if only you knew how my computer is up right now. I don't have my computer chair yet or a little desk or table. So right now I am using a bin because I just invented this. This is like a DIY desk I have right here, if only. I would show you, but it's kind of, it's, it's not a lovely sight. Anyways, today I thought it'd be fun to do a video taking Dragon Ball Z quizzes. Now I did this before and I remember how much I actually enjoyed doing these videos. I think they're fun. But anyways, so I'm just gonna have fun and take these quizzes and see what I get. I'm sure Goku is one of the results for these quizzes because it's Goku. Okay, so to start out, I am taking this quiz on Zoo. Which Dragon Ball Z character are you? Okay, question one, how strong are you? I work hard to get strong every day. I'm the strongest person I know. I'm kind of a punk. Um, <laughs> okay. True self isn't measured by physical strength. I don't know. Um, whew, I know I'm not the strongest person. I know. I'm not really a punk. Um, I'm gonna go with the first one. I work hard to get stronger every day. Check out these guns. You can't because I'm wearing a sweatshirt. <sighs> okay. Bing. Next question. What is your weapon of choice? A sword, a gun, my mind, the elements of the universe. <laughs> mm, I don't trust myself holding a sword. A gun? No. Guns honestly freak me out, so I would not choose a gun. My mind? Um, yeah. The elements of the universe. I'll choose that one. I think that would be awesome to use nature and use just the universe to attack people. Like I can be like, rain! Number three, what would you wish for if you got all of the Dragon Balls? For a happy life. That's so sad. To be the ruler of the world. Um, for all knowledge in the world. For peace. Um, I'm not too upset with my life right now to be the ruler of the world. Does that necessarily mean ruling evil in an evil way? Like, could I rule and bring peace to the world? Am I just in that position of power? Because I would honestly choose number two, but I don't, I think that means like in an evil sense. For all knowledge in the world, for peace. If there was peace, life would be kind of boring. Like, no more drama, but I'll choose peace. I'm gonna take this as honest as possible. Which, for these words, best describes you as a person? Passionate, funny, caring, wise. Um, I'm a very caring person, so I'll choose caring. That, was, that wasn't that hard. Number five, what is your favorite color? Blue, red, orange, and green. No purple! Purple is my favorite color alone. I don't really like any of these other colors. Like, blue is so basic. I'll choose blue. Do Dragon Ball Z characters even have a favorite color? Okay, number six. If you could choose one place to go to on vacation, where would you go? Hawaii. Tokyo, Japan, London. Oh my gosh, I want to go to all of these places. Oh gosh, uh, Phan, Phnom Pen, Cambodia. Oh, I really want to go to Hawaii and London, but I really want to go to Tokyo, Japan the most. So I'll go with Tokyo, Japan. Because then I get to see Frieza stuff everywhere and go buy all the Frieza things from Tokyo, Japan, so. Seven, when you were younger, which of these toys were your favorite? G.I. Joe action figures, Nerf guns, Legos building blocks. I didn't play with toys. See, I liked Nerf guns, but I definitely played with Legos more than anything. So I'm gonna choose Legos. I have no idea which character I'm gonna get with these answers. Number eight, who is your favorite superhero? Superman, Iron Man, Captain America, Martian Manhunter. Whew. Iron Man, baby. At least out of those ones. Number nine. Which of these superpowers do you wish you had? Super speed, invincibility, mind reading, 
shape shifting. Ooh. Super speed. I wish I could shape shift because then I could shape shift into a celebrity and just walk down like Hollywood Boulevard and just be like, hey guys, and like take autographs. And I'd be like, a hundred bucks, please, <laughs> for pictures. Um, yeah, shape shifting. It'd be kind of fun to be someone else for a day, so. Okay, 10. Which series, show, or video game is the best? Might Morphin Power Rangers. Is this Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? Mortal Kombat, Harry Potter, X Men. Power Rangers was like my childhood though, so I'm gonna have to do it. But it's like so corny. I don't But I like grew up on Harry Potter too, so. Hmm, but game. Ah. Uh, uh, this is like, what are these answers? I don't know. I'll choose Harry Potter. Wow, there's a lot of questions. Number 11. Which of these board games is your favorite? Monopoly, Sorry, Chess, Cranium. Oh, I'll say Monopoly. I just played that a lot with my family growing up, so we got into fights about like deciding who was going to be the banker. Number 12. Which video game console is the best of all time? Sony PlayStation, Microsoft, Xbox, Nintendo Game Boy, Super Nintendo. Ooh. I don't know. Game Boy, Game Boy was like my best friend as growing up, as sad as that sounds. I'll do PlayStation. Cause just the spiral games. Number 13, how do you stay fit? Boxing, weightlifting, eating healthy. I was born with great genes. I mean, I guess eating healthy because I don't I don't lift weights, I don't box. I'm not really born with great genes. 14. What do you slash would listen to when you're working out? Aerosmith, Beyonce, an audiobook, calming music. When you're working out? Who listens to calming music? I mean, I guess if you're like doing yoga or something, an audiobook. I mean, I'm, listen, I'm more of the, the uh, I would choose Aerosmith. Now, I don't really listen to Aerosmith, but I listen to that type of music, so I'll go with Aerosmith, I guess. Number 15, you have a lot of excess energy after working out. What do you do? Go running, lift more weights, cook, meditate. I would probably just go running. Like, whenever I have a lot of energy, I will just keep running. I'll go for walks with my dog, so it's just, yeah, I'll do that. Oh my questions. Maybe I'll only do two quizzes. This is a little too much. 16. Which of these burgers sounds the most delicious to you? Triple bacon cheeseburger, grilled chicken burger, veggie burger, no burger, just fries. I think the triple bacon cheeseburger sounds very good. So I'll choose that. 17. What is your favorite food in the world? Favorite food? I don't know. Cheesecake taco. What are these answers? Cheesecake tacos, fruit, and noodles. Cheesecake, honestly, you only really can have like one slice before you get sick of it, especially if it's from the Cheesecake Factory. I'll say tacos. I mean, tacos are delicious. You can't, you never can go wrong with tacos. Okay, 18. Which of these drinks is your go-to drink? Soda, energy drinks, tea, and water. I basically drink water like all the time, so. I mean, I have soda occasionally or like once a day. <laughs> but I really like my go-to drink is water. 19. Out of the following, what are you connected to the most? People, technology, books, and nature. I think I'm connected to people. I like being around people. I like talking to people, so I'm a very people person. Like, I, I don't like being alone for a long period of time. Whenever I take my dog for a walk, I always like talking to people or finding a reason to like talk to someone else that walks by me that's walking their dog. Like, I just need that human interaction on the daily. So, number 20. How would you describe your sense of style? Comfortable and laid back. Pretty flashy. Whatever my mom recommends. <laughs> Plain. I'm just, I'm more of a comfortable and laid back type of style. Like right now I'm wearing a sweatshirt. That should say a lot. I'm just comfortable. 20, oh, 21. Oh, this is a long quiz. 21, out of the following, which would be true about your emotional state? Be yourself no matter what. Show no weakness. An open book. I don't have emotions. See, I'm the type of person that if something's bothering me, you have to like really dig deep to like get me to tell you what's wrong with me. I have that problem where I'm very, I'm hard to budge. If there's something that's bothering me, I'll just be like, oh, whatever. 
or something, I'll bottle it up, especially with my friends. And like growing up, I don't really like showing emotion. It's I do have emotion though, but I think it's more of show no weakness. It's like my type of personality. Oh my gosh, 22. How many questions are there? This better give me a good result then. 22. You see a person you dislike, what do you do? Acknowledge their presence. Say something insulting. Get flustered. Nothing. See, that's me. Just, just nothing. As long as they don't bother me, but even then I won't really say anything. 23. Someone you dislike is choking. What do you do? Perform the appropriate maneuver to help the individual. Laugh. Call an ambulance. Wait for someone else to help them. Honestly, I'd probably be the one to wait for someone to help them, but not because I don't like them. I just would be afraid I would do something wrong. <laughs> I'll be the one that's back and waits. <laughs> 24. Your enemy and his gang have cornered you in the street. What do you do? No, you can beat them, but still try to prevent the fight. Show them no mercy. Run and hide. Mentally prepare yourself to kick some butt. Um... I probably would mentally prepare myself to kick some butt. I don't know if I'd be successful in that, but I'd mentally in my head. 25. Do you have a preference in armor? Something lightweight. I don't need armor. The heaviest and strongest available. A combination of heavy and lightweight. Probably would do lightweight armor. Do you live for a good fight? If it's for fun, definitely. I sure do. Let's go right now. I prefer to use my words over physical combat. I'd rather not engage anyone physically unless it is necessary. Do you live for a good fight? Mm, no, not really. I would go with I'd rather not engage with anyone unless it is necessary. 27. You're about to go off on an adventure. Who would you choose to accompany you? Someone who is really smart. I don't need anyone. Someone who's really strong. I would probably choose a smart person just because some of the decisions I make in my life aren't the smartest decisions, so I'd need that help. 28. What is the world's biggest problem? Violence, stupidity, ignorance, greed. I'm gonna go with stupidity. That's definitely a problem in today's society. <laughs> okay, 29. Who is, are, the most important persons in your life? Your kids and significant other. Why not just significant other? Why do you assume there's kids involved? <laughs> Yourself, your friends, your parents. Mm. Am I, I would say my parents are the most important. I would have, I mean, significant other I would have chose, but I don't, kids, no. <laughs> 30, what are you most afraid of? Losing my family, nothing and no more. Yeah, that's definitely a fear, losing my family. That's a scary spot. Oh, joy, I got Goku. One of my least favorite characters. So, I got Goku. You are a cheerful and carefree person, but that quickly changes when your going gets tough. You love competing for fun and tend to use violence as a last resort when solving problems. Go Goku always wants to fight. What is this? You are extremely loyal to those you love and your number one priority is taking care of those important in your life. Your heart is 100% pure. I have a 100% pure heart. <laughs> Not all of that is true about Goku, but okay. I'll take that I have a 100% pure heart. Maybe that's why I love Frieza so much. Because he's so unpure and I'm pure. 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 So I'm gonna take one more quiz. And this one is, which Dragon Ball Z character are you? By BuzzFeed. So the first question is, how do you stay fit? Weightlifting, swimming, I don't need to work out. I'm fabulous. Oh yeah. Jogging, yoga, MMA, dance, walking around the block, and monkey, monkey bars, okay. Um... I'll just do walk around the block. I mean, I go running, but that's really the only true thing. What's your favorite type of burger? Triple bacon cheat. <laughs> that's like an ongoing trend, I guess. Organic burger, veggie burger, a fancy $20 burger, protein style burger, replace the buns with lettuce, burger from the meat of an animal I just killed. No burgers, just fries, grilled chicken burger. I'll do a grilled chicken burger this time. Actually, I'll just be bougie and go a fancy $20 burger. Never had one of those. Um, if a person was choking, what would you do? Punch them in the stomach until the food dislodges. Perform the Heimlich maneuver. Wait for someone else to do... I'm, I'm noticing a trend in these questions. They're almost like the same. Wait for someone else to do something. Call an ambulance. Teach them the Heimlich maneuver. Wait, 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 wait. You would 
instead of performing it yourself, you would waste time and teach someone to do the Heimlich maneuver on someone that is choking. Like what? Why? <laughs> Laugh at their misery. That's just evil. Offer them some water. Here, you're, you're choking. Here's some water. I hope you're okay. <laughs> Offer them medical herbs. Act concerned, but ready <laughs> to not, but not really do anything. Oh no, you're choking. Oh God. Um, I would probably, <laughs> again, probably wait for someone else to do something. Whoever's going to teach someone else the Heimlich maneuver, you're obviously Nia. Like, that makes no sense, but okay. Pick a superhero. Superman, Iron Man, Jean Grey, Green Lantern, Batman, Wolverine, Spider-Man, The Hulk, Mr. Incredible. Oh, Batman. Batman. I love Batman. But oh, I like Spider-Man too. I'll do, I'll do Batman. Batman was just always a favorite growing up. What do you listen to when you're working out? Rocky soundtrack, audiobook. Beyonce, Journey. Oh, Journey. Love that. Classical orchestral music, Slipknot, Daft Punk, Yellow Magic Orchestra, video game soundtrack. Ooh, <laughs> I, I'm just gonna pick this because I listen to a lot of anime soundtracks and sometimes video game soundtracks when I'm running, but mostly anime and this is close enough. So I'll go video game soundtracks. Okay, ooh, Frieza, yeah, ooh, he's so cute. Okay, what would you do if you saw your sworn enemy? Challenge them to a fight. Find a diplomatic solution. Have someone else defend your honor. Walk away. Give them a you're dead to me look. Insult their mama. <laughs> Gather some backup. Offer them some weed. <laughs> Charm them until you're friends. <laughs> of. I'll do charm them until they're your friends. Pick a game. Candyland, Cranium, Apples to Apples, Sorry, Chess, Monopoly, Poker, Twister, Jumanji. <sighs> I like Apples to Apples. I just, Apples to Apples was always a funny game as a kid. Okay, pick your favorite toy. 90s G.I. Joe's, Legos, National Geographic Elements Science Kit. You know, sadly, I always wanted one of those as a kid and I never got one. Tyco Remote Control Car. Toys are for kids. Illegal fireworks? <laughs> Wait, are we talking about like my favorite toy right now or like as a kid? That's kind of... <laughs> Have you seen those videos where like kids lose their arms and hands because they make their own fireworks? Like, no. Nickelodeon Gak. Nerf guns, Beanie Babies, Legos again, I guess. Pick a franchise. Street Fighter, Harry Potter, X-Men. I'm just noticing this trend again. Power Rangers, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mortal Kombat, Buffy, Sailor Moon, The Muppets. Ooh my gosh, I love Buffy. Sailor Moon though, have to go with Sailor Moon. But if Sailor Moon wasn't in the equation, I probably would've picked Buffy. Pick a video game console, Super Nintendo, Game Boy, PlayStation, Dreamcast, PC, Sega Genesis, Atari Jaguar, NES, and Xbox. PlayStation for the win! Okay, which British TV personality would you dine with? Mr. Bean. I don't know. I really, I know Russell Brand, Mr. Bean, but I'll just do, I don't know any. Because I don't know if I'd want to dine with any of them. Which is your favorite Stanley Cuprick film? Oh gosh. Spartacus, Barry Lyndon, Space Odyssey, Doctor Strangelove, Full Metal Jacket, Clockwork Orange, The Shining, Eyes Wide Shut. <sighs> okay, so I don't really know who this guy is, but I've seen The Shining and I have also seen Doctor Strangelove, but Shining was kind of like one of those classics that, whoa, okay. I guess that was the end of the quiz. I got Chaozu. Your charm lies in your childlike qualities. You can make people smile by just being yourself. Don't worry about being the strongest. Your purpose is to boost morale, no matter how hard your day may be. Keep smiling, because you have no idea how powerful that smile can be. You know what, though? I don't know if I could relate this with Chaozu, but... You know, a lot of people tell me, they're like, oh, a smile. Like, growing up and everything. So I guess I could relate more with this answer than the other test answer. Whatever. So I got Goku and Chaozu. Obviously, I wasn't going to get Frieza because I'm not a psychopath, but 
you know, I love Frieza. I, I, it's like I don't want to be Frieza. I feel like people think I want to be Frieza. I love Frieza. But anyway, so I was going to take three quizzes, but this video is going to be long enough because that first quiz was so long. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like. And if you want to take the quizzes, I'll put the links in the description. But thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn the little notification bell on so you can see when my videos are getting posted. And just let me know if you want me to take more like fun online quizzes like this. I know I used to do them. As always, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Stay fresh and bye. Hold me close, try and understand Desire is hunger, is the fire I breathe Love is a banquet on which we feed Come on.